morning. Today, it's just us girls. So the boys went snowboarding today. I'm so excited for Floyd, and I'm so sad that I'm actually missing it. It's the first time he's been snowboarding this year, and he's so excited to go. It finally snowed here. So Chad took him up to the mountain, and it's a couple hours away. They're not gonna be there for very long, but it's a few hours drive, snowboard for a bit, and then come back. We started off our day by sleeping in. Oh, I feel so well rested today. <laughs> I have to tell you guys a nerdy little secret about me. You may already know it, uh, but I am such a Star Wars fan. I absolutely love Star Wars so much, and so my little guilty pleasure while well, I'm nursing. There are six episodes in like the Star Wars saga, 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 and the very last movie, The Rise of Skywalker, there's Ben Solo and Rey, and then there's the end scene where Ben Solo arrives to save Rey. <laughs> And because they can like telepathically like see each other and talk to each other and she goes to pass him her lightsaber and then runs to save her and then they walk up together and they both light their swords together oh I've watched it, I don't know how many times will I sit here and nurse. This is the bassinet I've been using for Franny and it works okay for now. But it, you can see it's kind, it's kind of on like a slant. So she could roll to like one side. She's not rolling yet, but she will be soon. So I don't actually think that this is going to work very well. Oh, this is my pile of diapers. Looking good. I have no idea what to do about a bed for Franny. I do plan on co-sleeping, but I like to have her in a bassinet for the first like few months while she's so little. So I've got some goals I want to get to today. I want to get on top of the laundry. Oh, I'm going to get her play mat and um i have to switch out all my clothes so all my maternity clothes i'm putting away and then i gotta get out all my normal clothes and put them back in my closet so that's super big because i have like nothing to wear right now it's such a challenge i'm gonna start by feeding myself so that's important and i'm gonna i have a little play mat i'm gonna put franny down and have some play time Speaking of my nerd alert Star Wars obsession, they just announced that The Mandalorian is going to be a movie. They're going to make a movie about The Mandalorian, which is like my, one of my favorite shows about Star Wars. Oh, the Mandalorian was so well done. Baby is sleeping, which means I have a window of time to get something done. And I think I'm just going to edit my video I'm working on right now because it's really, really important that I get it done and I... Don't know when else I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna try to just work on that video right now and then I'll get to my chores in a little bit. Okay, that lasted like five minutes. I'm nursing again, but something else I really wanted to do today is I'm gonna call a chiropractor to try to get Franny in for an appointment because um, the midwife said that she might need to be adjusted based on her shallow latch. And then I've also noticed she always leans really hard to one side. So maybe she is uncomfortable or she just needs some sort of adjustment. So I'm gonna call the chiropractor right now and see what they say. Well, that wasn't so bad. I got her in for an appointment already in two days. On Thursday, today's Tuesday. Franny is three weeks old today. It's 
flying by so fast, but I know it does already from Floyd. I can't believe Floyd was ever this little. I'm gonna switch the laundry. Are you gonna let me do that? I'll be right back. See, this is the side she always leans towards that side. It took me a while to notice that she always did that. But here, check out my laundry room. <laughs> Bathroom. This is clean laundry. This is clean laundry. This is clean laundry. I'm gonna switch what's in the dry washing machine to the dryer now. And I would love to get all of this done today, but I don't think that I am going to. Let's be realistic. Oh, okay. I'm coming, Franny. So Chad is actually going to be home in like 45 minutes with Floyd and I haven't done anything today. I have, I thought I would have this full day with me and Franny and I'd get all this stuff done. It was a delusion, obviously. I'm not even done editing this video and that's like the one thing I wanted to do. My bathroom is still a disaster. I haven't done any dishes. I've barely eaten. Oh, life is such a challenge. My biggest thing right now is like, I kind of want to move her because she's finally sleeping. She was awake for so long. She was like awake all day. I don't understand. But I'm afraid if I move her, she'll wake up. So now I'm just going to let her lay here. This this uh, nursing pillow is like a shelf. It's brilliant. I love it. But I'm also editing right here. This is my setup. Right? So I'm just going to keep editing and sitting here. I'm praying she doesn't actually wake up. Future Ashley here just sneaking in to mention a new brand that I'm working with, Hey Bud Skincare Line. For the last few months, I've really been looking for a skincare line I believe could help combat my adult acne, which causes me to have a lot of hyperpigmentation because I am a skin picker. I know, it's so bad. Hey Bud is a hemp-based skincare line that ticks all of my boxes and I am so excited to see what my skin is going to look like over the next few weeks. So here is my before. I'm not wearing any makeup except for some mascara and some chapstick, so this is my real skin. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel if you also have oily skin or acne. I will be using the clear skin all-stars line if you didn't know this about me i actually am an esthetician so i am very familiar with skincare products and i promise to show you my postpartum self-care skin routine very very soon i think she's still sleeping there i forgot today to take out some a frozen meal from the freezer for dinner i'm still living off of pre-cooked meals from the caterer that my mom got us and my girlfriend made us but I am going to try to do something about this laundry because Floyd's going to come home and rip it all apart. Well, I got through some of the laundry in here, at least, and I remembered to pull out a dinner meal for tomorrow. Tonight, I'm just gonna make my simple, I make like a, a chickpea sesame sticky rice thing uh, with broccoli on my pet tonight. I'm gonna sneak in a piece of cheese so that I can say I <laughs> ate today. I literally ate today a yogurt, a breakfast bar, a granola bar, and this piece of cheese. It is so hard to eat. Like, I don't even know why, but it is. This is a real, real, a real day in the life video for you. This is literally all that I can do in a day, but that's fine. I'm not too worried about it. 
I'm really enjoying Chad having paternity and being home with me. It has been making this transition flow a lot smoother. Very grateful. Thanks for watching. As always, I hope that you have a great rest of your day. We'll have a great rest of our day. I can't wait to hear about the boys' trip. I can't wait to hear how Floyd did snowboarding. So stay tuned. We're actually going on a snowboarding trip in two weeks. So I'll see you in the next video.